It's Sunday. There's nothing to do. It's one of those days where you've pretty much done everything, but there's all those little jobs to do. You know what I mean? I know what I can do. Follow me. I've been meaning to get the leaves off the garden for ages. So, let's give it a go. As you can see, the garden gets a bit clustered with that tree there. So, you know, I've been meaning to do it for some time, so it's about time I got around to it. All done. Worked like a treat, really, didn't it? Let's go and empty this bad boy. Let's get rid of all these leaves. Oh man, dusty. Oh yeah. Shall we go and pick Max up then? No knees. <laughs> he don't like being on camera. I thought it's a garage. The most a garage. Is that a garage? Yeah. It's a letterbox. There's the garage. We left Max the dog at my mum's because of the fireworks last night. Around here it's atrocious, I don't know what it's like where you live. But where I am, people just seem to let it off for three days solid. And he's um, a bit of a scaredy cat, so he hides under the bed, he shivers. So it's just best to take it to my mum's where she, you know, she lives in the country, so there's, there's not many fireworks around there. Let's go. Ready? Let's go home. Go Max, in. We're gonna stick it in the carrot so you can hold the carrot so it's further away from you. Yeah? <laughs> go ahead. Just hold it. Just watch it. No. Like that. Hold it there. You like it? Do you like it? Do you like it? Does it smell? Oh. I don't know, because I want you to be careful with it, Ollie. Don't touch it. Don't buy it. Don't buy it. Don't put your face near it. What? What? Wow. What? Wow. That's amazing. Right in. It's finished. It's finished. Is it finished? Oh, no. Then we put it in a bucket of cold water, don't we? Yeah? Yeah. Success. Success. Let's get it on. What's going to happen? It's going to go together like that. The pipe's going to go up and the pipe's going to come across the bottom. And that's going to be the side view to hold it in place. You'll see. So, in theory, that's going to be the side. This is going to be swapped for a 22mm. So basically there's going to be a pipe coming up there and across this way. See, working with copper isn't that hard. You can make lamps, anything out of it. It's, it's very easy to work with. Uh, and people pay a fortune for this sort of stuff. I mean, you can do it yourself. It's really not that hard, guys. It's really not that hard. I'm not doing any more today. It's not really what you want to be doing on your day off, is it? Let's be honest. So I'm going to do some more in the morning before work and hopefully get it finished. So I've just nipped out to get some bits and you know when you get that urge, that real 
urge to have a fatty, greasy, nasty McDonald's. I've got the feeling right now. So we're gonna make a quick stop. I've just been to McDonald's and you know when you find them incredibly rude? I mean, I don't know what their day's like, I don't know what it's like to work there now, but how rude can you be? I should have, I should have videoed it. There was no contact, there was no thank you, there was no smiles, there was no please, there was just, there was nothing. When, when I gave them the money, there was nothing. When I took the order, there was nothing. Just a receipt. Thanks McDonald's, you shine again. It's about time we got cracked back on with this really, before work. So I've got some more fittings now. So that's going to fit onto there, and then obviously the post is going to come up and across. So it's going to be a nice little stand, copper stand, once it's done and polished up. I think it's going to look, you know, decent. It's only to hang notices off, um, or leaflets. I guess we'll see what it's like when it's finished. Bit done. Now for stage three. That's a stand pretty much done, really. Just need to add a, add a couple of more bits and we'll be sorted. Let me show you. Let me show you. Just... See, that's what it is. And there's going to be a coffee machine going in between it. And then on here, there's going to be a tea piece with a 15mm branch sticking up. And again over here. And then it's going to have one of these on it, on the branch. And stick out like that. And it's, you're going to have a bit of wood screwed along there for the display. So all in all, I think it's quite successful. So this is pretty much done, guys. I just need to polish it up and make it look pretty. It's been quite a little... Uh, a nice little challenge if I'm being honest. Quite enjoyed it. Ignore the glasses, they're just to distract you from my poor craftsmanship. I'm just joking, this is actually really good and I'm proud of it. So like I say, a nice little polishing up. The wooden plaque's gonna go across here obviously like we said. And that's gonna be the display. Do I recommend doing it at home? Yeah. Play about with it, you know. I mean copper items, copper lamps, stuff like this. They're expensive, really expensive guys. And this has probably cost 30 quid, all this copper pipe and all these fittings if that. Now to do a lamp you're not going to need that much, you're probably going to need probably two meters worth, so that's what you can buy it in, or we'll just get some knocked off. That's pretty much the end of today's vlog guys, hope you enjoyed it, hope you try something like this at home and I hope it's inspired you in some sort of way. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and smash that subscribe button and I'll see you on the next vlog.